Hello, hello, hello. Nathaniel Crawford here at the future home of the amazing South Flagler house. I wanted to do a quick, quick video. Uh, you see the green space there in front of the Norton Museum. Uh, wanted to do a quick video to just do a walk by. I got a, a couple calls that people were asking me if the South Flagler site was affected by the recent hurricane. So, and I am happy to report that there is no, no visible damage here in the South Flagler House area. And of course I have to, gotta show those views. Got to show those views. Yes. So as you can see, uh, there is uh, no damage here uh, caused by uh, Hurricane Ian on this side. We do know there was a fair amount of, of damage in the Tampa Bay, uh, St. Pete area, a lot of that West Coast uh, stuff. So those, those folks are definitely in our prayers and we're reaching out to, to some family and friends we got over there to make sure they're okay. Uh, we had some, some colleagues that actually evacuated and ended up over on this coast for a couple of days, so they'll be with us for a while. Uh, but yes, as you can see, the future home of South Flag House is still there. Uh, you got some uh, site action there at our neighboring uh, development. Uh, if you don't already know, I can give you some of the, the highlights uh, before I jump off here. This will be the first tower by the uh, renowned architect Robert A.M. Stern. There will be amazing interiors by the wonderful people over at Pembroke and Ives. This uh, tower will feature three, four, and five bedroom uh, residences, townhomes, uh, condos, penthouses. Uh, it's gonna be some amazing stuff with amenities second to none. This is, is really gonna be something beautiful. And of course, those views, those views. Some of the most amazing sunrises in all of South Florida and <laughs> but wait, there's more. This will also be the tallest uh, residential tower in all of West Palm Beach. So those views, you get them both this way and you'll get some views that way too. So that means you have the, the sunrise and sunset uh, views in the wonderful city of West Palm Beach. And we're gonna take a couple more steps over here so we can get a quick glimpse of what will be the Ann Norton Sculpture Garden right there. Got the Norton Museum back there. This will be our wonderful uh, sculpture garden on this side of the development will actually be where all the townhomes will be located opening right into that wonderful townhome era, uh, sculpture garden area. Beautiful, beautiful stuff there. If you check out some of the other videos on the channel, there's some renderings there to show you some of that stuff. If you have any questions, you know, send me a direct message or comment below. I'm happy to share some additional information, some renderings with you. We can set up some time to talk. Uh, time uh, Starting price here is going to be around $10 million uh, with completion dates probably in the 2025, 2026 uh, era. Uh, timeline. So if you have any questions, as always, my name is Nathaniel Crawford. I am here to help you accomplish your real estate goals. Let's talk soon.